taking the stats every minute this week. I'm doing my part, I'm paying attention, and I play my position. It's Crypto Lightsaber back with another video guys today we're going to talk about squid grow which i haven't spoken about in a little while had a little break from talking about a lot of projects to be honest but squid grow if you've been following the channel probably my favorite meme coin out of all of them over the past year or so right and um the developer of this is a man called shiptoshi who's a one of the biggest shiba inu whales worth billions and billions of dollars also a bitcoin billionaire and um yeah, we're going to talk about this project because for me, it's looking like it could be potentially be a bottom for this particular token. I'm not saying that the bottom is in. I'm saying it could be a potential bottom, which is why I've been loading up on Squid Girl. But remember, none of this is financial advice. Do your own research. Don't risk more than what you can afford to lose. I'm only showing you what I'm doing or what I'm buying, right? But if you look at the chart for Squid Girl, we've seen a lot of volume coming in over here, which says to me accumulation, right? But um, on uh, the, we're on the four hour chart, right? What I want to show you is the fact that it looks like we could have broken a resistance uh, that's been going on for the past, uh, since August, right? If we look over here, since about August, okay, we've had a resistance. Of course, it was a parabolic run on Squid Grow. So, you know, me, I've been accumulating from the highs into the lows, right, guys? Um, kind of through everything that I knew about buying a dip out of the window when squid grow launched right we had this big dip over here and i've been buying squid grow all over here all right guys but of course we're in the bear market so everything's taking a hit but squid grow right now looks like it could have bottomed out potentially right it's broken through this resistance in fact you could actually draw a descending triangle on this chart which of course it would be a bullish breakout all right there's a high percentage normally between you know 60 to 70 percent um uh chance that something like this can break to the upside and right now we are seeing it break to the upside right so anyone that could read charts will look at this uh, and, and anyone that does pattern trading right they go on a four hour they're probably going to see this as a potential buying position especially if it was to pull back but it did break out and uh, try to pull back a little bit um but it is going up and it's basically bashed through this resistance right here as well as you can see right here we broke it through that resistance and uh, it kind of actually did retest that uh, resistance as support and now we see it move into the upside so that is pretty bullish on the actual squid grow chart um, another thing that i find bullish is going into 2023 right we've been expecting squid grow exchange uh, the ethereum launch uh, the ethereum bridge all of which is ready and shiptoshi is probably just waiting for the best time to launch that right this video just came out last night from squid grow on their official youtube uh youtube channel right and um you've got uh i'm guessing that shiptoshi showing one of his watches i don't know if that's a richard mill or something like that right but basically what you can see is a bunch of lines of code my phone is ringing just give me a second Right, you can see a bunch of lines of code, right? I know there's thousands of lines of code. Can't remember exactly how much, but um, this is basically what they're showing in this video, right? Throughout the whole video, it's just literally him scrolling down with Squid Grow beats, um, rap songs that have been made about Squid Grow in the background, right? So basically for three minutes, you can see him scrolling down thousands, or looks like hundreds of thousands of lines of code uh, on this particular project, which I'm guessing is for Squid Grow X, SGX, the Squid Grow Exchange, decentralized exchange platform, right? So something that makes me bullish about that as well is uh, we've seen obviously with FTX and things that happen there, um, people are gravitating more towards decentralized exchanges. We've seen GMX and Gains Network, GNS and DYDX and all those sorts of decentralized exchanges pumping right one inch uniswap all those sorts of things so sgx squid grow exchange um obviously launching in that same type of narrative right we could see uh you know in the ball run right we could definitely see um some massive gains out of the actual squid grow token which is directly connected to squid grow exchange or sgx right so um if you listen to the recent amas from shiptoshi he talks about squid grow exchange um and you know the fact that it's going to be his baby or it is his baby and squid grow token is his baby and um you know everything to do with squid grow exchange is going to directly feed into the squid grow token right so that has got me bullish on this token and going back to the chart of course you know for me that is a bullish setup right 
um, if I was looking for um, a breakout pattern that was bullish, I'd say this is the one right now. And, um, you know, the market cap is sitting at 7.2 million, $484,000 in liquidity. You know, this is a really, really bullish project, in my opinion. Of course, you know, I have that bias. I'm holding the token. Uh, but I've been talking about it for a while. You know, you don't see me on this channel continuously shilling the same meme coin over and over again. I pick different ones. I talk about different ones all the time, but I rarely give them more than one, more than two videos, right? But on this one, I'm continuously talking about it because I take it seriously, right? I've got a big bag of this, a lot more than what I will put in any other meme coin, right? Um, you know, outside of Shiba Inu or Dogecoin, for example. Uh, Squid Grow for me is the number one play in terms of potential growth in the meme coin um genre all right guys so 7.2 million in market cap you know what's the potential for this to go to 70 70 million right it already hit 50 million at its all-time high i believe it's going to hit 70 million right can it hit 700 million you know it's not out of the question you look at things like shiba inu go to billions and billions of dollars uh but then it's can it hit 70 billion that's when you know we're really looking at a shiba inu competitor right but right now um this to me is probably a good bet to go into i actually liquidated a lot of my polka dot and uh bnb uh to to ape more into squid grow right because you know when i look at the market caps of those and i think you know what what can i liquidate you know there's some fod on binance um although i am bullish on the bnb token long term um dot really hasn't been performing pretty well for a while anyway and um you know does it make sense to liquidate assets during the bear market i think it makes sense if you're swapping it out for assets with a higher potential i think that squid grow has a much higher potential than um let's just go with dot right it's got a much higher potential than dot in terms of you know uh, price appreciation right now right i'm not saying that is better than dot or better than bnb or better than anything right i'm just looking at looking at market cap and looking at potential with everything they've got coming out the, the ethereum bridge uh, squid grow exchange and all that sort of stuff right and another thing is i actually believe that uh, before the eth launch the binance version is going to pump because people are going to be able to swap their bnb or you know a bridge over there they're going to be able to use the bridge to swap their bnb version for the eth version right but in order to get the eth version you need to buy the in order to swap to get the higher percentage, right, you need to hold the BNB version. So a lot of people will probably want to load up on the BNB version to swap for the Ethereum version. And uh, that's a whole video in itself, right, guys? But yeah, I think we're going to see a much higher market cap than what we're seeing right now. Um, so short-term gains, I think that that is pretty much imminent, um, depending on when they actually launch the uh, the excuse me the ethereum bridge and the squid grow exchange which i believe is going to be soon right i'm i'm not going to say it's in january i'll just say it's in 2023 and um yeah so 2023 is literally like a week away less than a week away right so you know i think it's pretty imminent that the price is going to go up on this particular project but remember it's not financial advice it's just speculation um so you know just do your own research make up your own mind okay guys remember this is a mean coin it's very high risk this is crypto. It's the Wild West out here. Uh, so, yeah, just make sure you know what you're doing and don't lose more than what you can afford to lose and all that sort of stuff. All right, guys. So, just wanted to give you that update. My take on Squid Grow. Still super bullish on this token. Got a breakout right here. And, um, you know, it'd be nice if we could see this pump. Give us a nice little pump. You know, in the short term, we could see 50, 70, 100% out of this token, maybe. I don't know. All right, guys. But, um, yeah, I do believe that we're going to go up. And I'm actually up since my previous buys anyway on this breakout. So that, I'm super happy about that. All right, guys. So links are in the description. You guys can check this out for yourself. Do your own research. Check out the website. Go and follow them on Twitter. Jump in the Telegram and so on. They've got NFTs, uh, uh, new things launching all the time. Um, constantly updating on Twitter. So, so you, you definitely want to be on Twitter. And um, check out my previous videos on this as well. But um, yeah, super bullish on Squid Grow, guys. Let me know what you think in the comments. Do me a favor if you're not subscribed to the channel, subscribe and tick the little bell for notifications. I'll see you guys in the very next video.